Hi guys, I'm Crash Cancer here and today I'm bringing you another episode of Party Farming Raids and today we've got some decent raids for you. I haven't done much recently because the loot's been terrible since the last update, mainly because of obviously everyone's farming, most people come online so all the inact inactive bases have gone active again, stuff like that, it's quite annoying so I'm just going to work with what we got here. So we've got a few lower raids, I've got one really nice high raid because I got that today and they just went all out because I thought don't get this raid kind of very often so put all our troops and all our spells in, you know go all out. So um, also I think a real problem with her at the moment recently is that our queen, she's been really bad, like the AR on her is just terrible. Like for some reason she's currently outside the base all the time so easily. Uh, obviously I know Supercell tried their best to um, change her from a wall breaker which she usually is which is really annoying but they seem to change her into a pecker which is even worse. So you know it's um, I appreciate them trying to do something about it but I'd appreciate it if they give it another whack because at the moment it's not doing too well. But from what I can I can tell from the forums, there seems like there's going to be a um, like bug fix, and hopefully we'll get a bit of a queen tweaking in there to try and stop her going around the outside of the base so easily. Because in war, she really doesn't like going for that town hall or any of the units that you wanted to. Let's be perfectly honest here. Like you saw, you're gonna see on my life raid today that um, we don't really get much help, and the raiding is a lot harder now. And I think it's a uh, Partly to do with the Dark Spell Factory, we've got to get that upgraded and start using some of that stuff. But I think it's also to do with the Queen AI and how AI has changed. Oh, well, that, that, that Healy spell at the bottom there, you might know, question that. That's only because our King and Queen took ages to regen, and it just really couldn't be bothered to wait for them for ages. Because on this raid, I had to wait 20 minutes after all my troops had trained just so I can get my heroes. So that's kind of why I did that. So I got 270k gold and 280k elixir. But this next raid, oh my god, look at that. 411,000 gold available. And obviously 400k elixir, but we're more going for that gold at the moment because we want to get another cannon done because we want to get maxed out, but the loot isn't very good. And I'm not farming a massive amount, I don't know why. I mean, just during the summer, I'm kind of on my computer and I forget I've got my iPad open, so I kind of just, yeah, not doing too well. But I got a spell heavy in this one because I'm after the gold, not really the elixir. I think the uh, spells are a good investment. I was surprised when the queen didn't go and do something else instead of going through that wall because that's a lot of effort for her. And increasingly recently, she hasn't exactly wanted to put much effort in. I don't know if that's, you know, some woman thing, but she's on something. <laughs> Yeah, sorry about the screen now. I forgot I turned upside down, so it's gone back to normal there. So the king on the right side, he's doing quite good work. I put a um, healing spell on him. I think I did anyway, just to get him some more health. But queen goes for that gold storage. After we put a rage on her, second ash down, we can surrender. But obviously, both heroes got quite low health there, so it'll take a while for them to regen. And the last raid here is not a massive raid, but we still just go for it. And uh, I think we're about 2 million gold away from our last cannon, which is going to be. Yeah, quite painful uh, doing all that stuff. So we are going to be farming quite a bit over the next few days. Hopefully, trying to get that done before the um, end of the weekend. I think it's the best kind of timeline. I think we should be able to get that done in. And if we win the recent war in, which doesn't seem very likely because it's a tough war and this uh, enemy we're against at the moment seems to know what they're doing. I think it might be next war or whatever. Uh, I'm also on visits to a few other clans so if I get included in the selection and all that kind of stuff. So it'll be interesting. So I also just want to kind of I'll make a video on a clan that I'm. I think I'll make a video anyway on a clan that I'm going to visit because they're quite cool. So yeah, this uh, raid went alright. We've uh, got most of the loot. We've got the Dark Elixir, which is always nice. Not much of it though. And we've also, there's also still two gold storages left. One gold storage the king just took down. And one other one, which our queen might go for. But she doesn't because she's a queen. And now she's got some weird AI thing. Whereas before, she might shot through that wall and got the gold storage. Now she just doesn't want to do anything. So we kind of let it go out and see if we can get her to miraculously go for that gold storage. But no. She's got to be zapped by that test, so it doesn't really help us. So yeah, thank you much guys for watching. I'll see you next time.